Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to use the ultimate vacation yacht. Let's get started. This thing is amazing. It's now on workshop, by the way, but I'm going to show you guys how to get this thing started. But so for the lights in here, you're going to want to click that button right there. It's kind of in a weird area, but that'll just have to do. And then that's how you turn on your engines and systems. Systems is like all your monitors, radar, and all that fun stuff. And then right here is your speed control. So up and down is your throttle. And this thing is actually pretty quick for a yacht and it sticks out of the water, which I kind of like, like it just looks really cool and it has some really good turning on it. But I'm basically going to show you guys all the details in in this yacht so right here we have like the captain seat our emergency battery right here that we can click on but we have an infinite generator so that really shouldn't ever be used but you know sometimes stuff might happen all uh, right here we have a ton of midship bilge pumps and then our water type bulkhead doors which is really cool so if we close those it will actually close all these doors right here you kind of just saw it close right there for a split second but very cool door setup we got there uh we made that last video so let's go ahead and open those back up even though you could probably keep them closed always all right right here's our anchor control so anchor down and anchor up pretty cool engine rps and temperatures if that gets above 115 we will have issues make sure you shut down the engine if that ever does happen but on the actual pilot seat here we have number one for our navigational lights which will activate these red and green lights right here and the number two is our deck lights so at nighttime our deck lights are definitely necessary so with them off you cannot see anything with them on it's just perfect so that's how you can load up the jet ski and just see everything out there all right and then over here we have a whole bunch of defibrillators repair equipment uh flares just in case you know because sometimes we do sing which you know never will happen out here on deck i'll show you guys kind of what's going on out here so really up here just a couple tanning beds nothing crazy going on up here but a clear view with the wind hitting your face okay that's amazing with our two fog horns out there we'll go up there in a second but back here's our hot tub controls so right here we have this button which activates the heaters for the hot tub and then this thing will automatically fill itself to the certain level it should be at the hot tub is fitted with multiple seats i think four so you can just sit here and chill while we are driving it's getting a little bit rough out oh gosh the waves are starting to pick up i thought i chose a good day for this but back here we have the jet ski which i'll probably should stop this boat if i'm going to try using it so let's go up here and then right here we click engines and now it'll completely shut them down all right so for this jet ski here you're going to want to disconnect that so right here you're going to want to click this button right here and it'll release the light boat slide it straight off and number one is how you turn on your engine on the light boat and you'll know your engine is on when all these are glowing and s and w are your throttle s is reverse which is pretty cool these waves are actually starting to get really rough but this is a pretty cool little jet ski is really fast and this is full speed for you i'll show you guys here in a second it even has that little water shoot thing out the back which is super realistic but look at this thing it's awesome and we can reload it back on so that's kind of the cool part about it, it might be kind of hard in this type of weather if i'm going to be honest but we can try that we can try reloading it um of course i'm going to have to try that so we're going to load it up here okay we are coming in we have to line it up with that um it's kind of uneven okay we're gonna try lining it up just like this and ramp it up and i uh, yeah we're definitely not on it. and at number three is your headlights if you kind of want help so you can see that bottom part right there you're going to want to line that up with the center of your center console here so if we just do this perfectly like this it should just work and there we go okay now we are up perfect and you're going to want to turn on our sticky throttle so number two is our sticky throttle it'll just keep boosting itself up like that and while it's boosting you're going to want to reconnect the cable oh my gosh okay it's getting a little bit scary here and then rope up so it'll just bring the jet ski up with that anchor and now it is completely up we're going to turn off the engine and turn on this brake right here and this thing is at a complete stop just like that that's how you reload this thing a pretty cool little jet ski there and if we go back inside we're really listing i was just because of the way we can actually go on the dance floor right here so this is where all the party stuff happens we got a second bar we have another bar downstairs which i'll show you here in a bit but right here you can turn on our lights and then the led lights for all the drink stands but yeah up here you can party so if you have an emote you can do take me and then it'll do this like fortnite dance right here pretty cool okay so right here's our radar our second radar and our two fog horns with all of our weather sensors and stuff so our wind sensor clock humidity sensor a whole bunch of stuff right there and of course we have some drinks on the sides but let's go down a floor and i'm going to show you guys what's going on kind of near the water line so down here we have the light button right there and then a washing machine which i don't think works at all you know storm works uh, but that's pretty cool a washing machine and then right here's the vip bedroom so this would be the captain's bedroom or whoever you think is important and a tv screen there's nothing on that tv yet i don't know if we're going to do that but a picture of a random yacht right here that kind of looks like ours but it, i don't think it is and then right here is the bathroom with our golden toilet oh that is just amazing looking and then that's the vip room for you right there this is the second bathroom so we have a shower with a bamboo plant or whatever that is right there some seating and these are the two crew bedrooms that you can just go ahead and chill in and then we have some led lights on the back wall which looks really cool so both of these are fitted with a bunk bed they're completely um symmetrical on both sides so same thing in both rooms uh that neotastic logo which looks very cool and that's basically those bedrooms and right here is 
the bar. Okay, this is where all the fun stuff happens. Right here, we have the LED lights, which will activate all those cool looking lights right there. The disco ball, that thing, that spinny thing, normal lights. So we can just turn off the disco ball or turn it on, whatever you want to do. And then in the actual bar, we have some burners right here and a whole bunch of actual expensive drinks. And then the most expensive ones are blocked off in that glass shelf right there. And we have a table right here that you can do some crazy stuff on. But back behind this room is actually a whole bunch of equipment and the engine room. So this is where all of our powerful engines are at. These are super powerful engines, super charged and everything. Um, super good cooling also. For shut down, you're going to want to disable this. So if the engine's running, just click that. Even though it's already on, it's just kind of like opposite. A manual bilge pump right here, just in case there's water in here, which, you know, never will happen. Uh, right here is our infinite generator back there with like that little notepad thing on it. And then these are some of the engine room bilge pumps, which is perfect. And then we actually have an active stabilizer in this thing that's working right now. It's kind of getting a little bit wavy, so it's working pretty hard. There's four bilge pumps in each compartment. Um, let's go ahead and try maybe um, spawning a tsunami in and see how this thing does. So tsunami spawned and I've actually never tested a tsunami against this thing. We're going to turn off the headlights on this jet ski here because those are really bright. Okay, there we go. And tsunami spawning somewhere. Let's not capsize the boat. Actually, I don't even think this thing can capsize, but let's go ahead and turn on all engines full speed here and see where this tsunami is spawning from. So we should see a big bulge start. I think that's definitely it over there. And we're going to start turning ourselves towards it. This is just such a great looking yacht with our hot tub and everything out here. This is a work in progress though. Like I'll definitely add some stuff to this thing off screen or maybe I'll record some of it. I did that with the um, submarine. I posted a video like this on it and I continued adding stuff like the ROV. But here we go. We're going to be ramming this tsunami with our brand new vacation yacht now on workshop if you want to go subscribe to it in the description and we're on full speed. So we should definitely be able to climb this thing with these powerful engines. This just looks super cool. And we're going to start rising it here any second. Let's see if we have enough engine power to rise it. I'm sure we do. Honestly, these are super large engines and we're not even dipping underwater. That's actually really impressive. Uh, never mind. We are okay right here. You're going to want to shut down the engines because that'll definitely. Oh, gosh, this is not good. We've got too much air time. Oh, this is going to hurt. We're going to pierce the water right here and oh, Wait, hold on, our swimming pool. Wait, are we gonna flip over? Oh no, oh, we're gonna flip. This is not what I wanted to happen. Okay, it flipped over, but then it should auto flip back over. Guys, look at this. This thing cannot capsize. That's very cool. I don't know how we even managed to do that. I wasn't planning on it, but I'm fine with it. And I think we're actually keeping up pretty well with the tsunami here. Let's turn on this. We're on full throttle still. So yeah, we're kind of keeping up with it. It's outrunning us slightly. That's a fast tsunami, but that's basically how you use this yacht. I'm gonna add a scuttle button here in the future, probably on a video. So make sure you stay tuned for that. But that's probably going to be it for this video. I was just going to show you guys how to use this thing. It is now in workshop. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. Hit that bell. Join the Discord. Link is in the description. But thanks for watching and goodbye.